Are you troubled by strange noises in the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or your family actually seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Just pick up the phone and call the professionals. Call the Ghostbusters. Serving all your supernatural elimination needs 24 hours a day. Ghostbusters. We're We're ready ready to to believe believe you. you. Franchises available soon. Call for details. Russell, hey man, you near the East Wing? Yeah. But by the new Ghostbuster exhibit? Yeah, why? There's something headed your way. Get dressed up as Attila the Hunt again. I'm gonna smack you. Wait. And I hear something. I'm gonna take a look. Wanna hear something really creepy? I was reading about Shandor, you know, the guy who donated most of the Gozer stuff. He was into the occult. You know, supernatural. Weird dude. Why don't we talk about it some other time? Any other time. Hey, you can't be in here. Stop! Summon dead family members and test them so you can ask the combination to the same. Yeah, well, same to you, pal. Another exciting night, huh? Oh, and you get refrigerator privileges. But listen, if you didn't put it in there, you don't want to eat it. Especially if it looks like cottage cheese. No, ma'am, they are willing to believe you. <laughs> well, if they go ahead with this franchise, then I can tell you one thing. I am not schlepping out to work in Philadelphia, God knows where every time someone needs a fresh pot of coffee. <laughs> This might be... We'll start at 50% capacity. That should keep any burning or tissue damage to a minimum. Hey, if you're gonna burn any tissue, do it to the new guy. You can't use Ray. Our mortgage is in his name. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? No names, Ray. I don't want to get too attached to this kid. You know, just in case <laughs> you remember what Evan was getting. Hey, how come this mump gets all the new stuff? He's our new experimental equipment technician. He gets a cool title, too? It means he gets to carry around a bunch of untested, extremely dangerous hardware that, if not handled correctly, could blow him somewhere into New Jersey. Oh, this knucklehead lugs around our very dangerous prototype hardware that could potentially blow us into New Jersey. Thanks. Keep the title, kid. It'll work hard for you. Was that us? Had to be some sort of psi energy pulse. Substantial. A significant collected and centralized necromatic convulsion, level 7 or more. I know the answer, but I'm going to ask anyway. Is a level 7 uh, whatever bad or... Very bad. On a scale of 1 to 10, I would say, let me guess, it's a 7. Let's just say we're about to get real busy. And that is not the fun kind of getting busy. Is it, Ray? Look out! Slimer's escaped again! 
too, Ray. The Cedric Hotel. The first place that little fun will go. No. Oh, it won't be necessary to call before they arrive. Believe me. You'll know it. Nothing to worry about, folks. There's absolutely no need to panic. We are highly paid to train for me. Thanks for having me home. Try to look highly trained. That disgusting green blob is up on the 12th floor again wreaking havoc. I demand a refund right now. Sir, if you check the fine print on our invoice... Invoices. Right, invoices. You'll see that your warranty on rehaunting expired some time ago. You should have taken the extended service agreement. I'm getting some interesting PKE spikes here. Disturbances don't seem to be exclusive to the 12th floor. I'd like the chance to look around the building a little. Pick up what you can. That little greenie shouldn't cause us too much trouble. Part of our settlement with the city, proton packs must remain off in heavily populated public areas. And in close quarters. It minimizes the city's liabilities and satisfies the restraining order the maid here had put on us. The world we live in today. You shoot a proton stream of highly charged particles at someone, they get all so happy. We didn't even burn her. I mean, there was redness. There was some redness. Well, hello. You're perfectly safe now, Miss. The ghost is your here. Never gonna happen. Cab, please. To Times Square. <laughs> that approach ri Stance, if you'd do the honors. Proud to, Dr. Venkman. All right, showtime. We wear him out, then we capture him. That's what your proton stream is for. Bear him up, Slick. Full release! Now, Cadet! You've got him on the run! Come on, let's go! Peter! Yeah, I've seen this one already. You know how it ends. You two have fun, though. I'll cover the elevators and escort any ladies safely to their rooms. I've got a solid signal. Get over here and look at your PKE meter. All right, dig it. Your PKE meter is the cornerstone of any supernatural investigation. Works like a divining rod. Pointed at psychokinetic energy, it measures electromagnetic fluctuations and heats up. Pointed away, it goes cold. Hot is better. Just follow the signal to your target. And this signal looks just like your elusive little targeted entity.
He's definitely been here. Looks like he cleaned out all the snacks. <laughs> Peter, come in. You okay? Uh-oh, man down. But he's been slimed again. Hustle over here and help him up, will you? The mutant Stromboli snuck up on us. You guys need to get down here immediately. Our living science experiment is tearing apart the lobby, and he's not alone. More ghosts? But we gave this hotel a clean bill of health five years ago. New people die every day. Call the elevator, Junior. I'm not taking the stairs. Uh, today's not my cardio day. Can we please call Winston and tell him his night off is officially ended? Did Ray show you how to use the PKE meter? Using the signals for tracking is helpful, but you can also perform a full target ident scan on a variety of paranormal entities. Try it on any one of those ghosts. Just line up your... Nice work. A completed scan initiates a cross-reference query to all digitally available material. And instantly updates the entry in your onboard Tobin spirit guide. This provides an active and useful data search. Oh, am I glad I stayed home that year. The education, the only one being paid to learn on the job is this poor... Zap Cadet. You've got trouble! Let out! Great, follow me. The others are floating back upstairs. Venkman, you two pull our friend Slimer into a trap as fast as you can. There's a massive bulge in these spikes indicating this isn't just some routine clearing job. He gets so bossy he has even went to his lab. Hey now, is that honey glazed ham in front? There, the Alhambra ballroom. No way he could pass that. Absolutely not. You can't go in. The Rodriguez bar mitzvah is set to start in half an hour. I'm telling you. You bring your apron? You're going to take a little shortcut through the kitchen. Be careful, Peter. Remember the Ellis Island incident? Hamba should be right through here. Okay, champion, you leave for a while. This is why I eat out of the can. Nothing to worry about. Most kitchens have self-starting fire. Just a little air in the line.
Oh, cheers. I'm feeling pretty good. How about you? You know, I thought that guy said Rodriguez Armas, huh? What it killing? The next in green salad, one in a white. I'm gonna take back blast him until he's dazed and throw the capture. Good. That's it, buddy. You've got to watch your breathing. Casey, okay, right where you want him. Now, try to hold him still. you got to wear him down. You can wear him out even faster. See? That's a big one. I'll teach that pitiful goop sack to slime be an eggman. And by extension, you. Yeah, I'm for ballroom. The bomb is for... What have you done? The curtains are arriving in 15 minutes. What seems to be your problem? Thanks to me and my new exclusively assigned recruit here, the festivities can now proceed in an entirely ghost-free environment. So, you're welcome, huh? And to all the Rodriguez's, Lachayim from the Ghostbusters. Nice of you guys to join us. You grab the little spud? Mashed potatoes now. Your cadet has a straight mouth. Ray, we need to have a heart to pull out and talk with this one. Or we are going to have this bunch of opportunity. Uh-oh. Heads up, your initiation is over. Now give us a hand. We've got a couple of really persistent, troublesome spirits here. You've got trouble. Heads up. Take a tip, punk. Don't mess with the men in days. on the door, do not disturb. No molestate. Got it? 
Watch out! Hostile FRB! Throwing projectiles! <laughs> huh? That guy looked lost. Ray, let's go check the fridge. Let them go to this guy. Cadet, go with Dr. Spengler. Check out that angry chef. This way. Looks like he's drifting upstairs. Iconic vibrations seem to be amplifying their energy. Their manifestations are becoming more powerful and dangerous by the second. But don't be afraid. We
Good work. Are you all right? Nice going. You might really be the right person for this job. Yes, you have destroyed a significant section of a five-star New York hotel in just under three hours. Your mother and I are so proud. Are we, Egon? He's got something. Let's track it down. I need to remember that the apple does not fall far from the tree when it comes to poltergeists. They usually manifest as what they were in their physical life. A mailman will be a mailman, and in this case, a chef will be a chef. Granted, an evil chef, but still a chef. So we need to figure out what will make this guy mad and draw him out, culinarily speaking, of course. Hey, you think he'd make us some pancakes? No, Peter, I think he's trying to make us into pancakes. <laughs> Whoa, that's breath control. to make do with uh, this new specimen here. I've been trying to get here for over four hours, Peter. Traffic is a little blocked right now. Wait. I know that thud. Winston, what do you see out there? 